What are the benefits of reporting a dog bite to animal control? Hi, I'm Josh Rorschach. I'm a personal injury lawyer in Central Illinois. And when we represent people who've been involved in dog bites or animal attacks, we recommend that they promptly report the incident to their local animal control authority. There are a few reasons why. First, the animal control authority can investigate the incident. They can go and talk to the dog's owner and they can talk to witnesses who saw the bite and make a report about what happened. This report can be really useful to you in proving your case later if you pursue a dog bite claim. Number two, the animal control authority can ask the dog's owner for a vaccination history, which is very important because you wanna know whether or not a dog has had a rabies vaccine. In some situations, if the dog has not had a, a current rabies vaccine, it'll be necessary or a recommended uh, medical protocol for you to have a series of painful shots to protect yourself if the dog wasn't vaccinated. If that can be avoided because animal control talked to the dog owner and they got records showing the dog's vac vaccinations were current, that can save you or a family member or a child from going through a painful series of shots. Number three, um, it's a good idea to talk to animal control because they can help you determine if the dog had any kind of a prior bite history. That's really important because if a dog's owner has been irresponsible over and over again, that can be a factor that can significantly improve the value of your claim because it creates risk for the at-fault party if the jury might be um, angered by knowing that they're a very irresponsible dog owner and that their, their conduct has resulted in multiple people being hurt by their dog. Okay, number four um, is kind of related to number three, and that is you're really doing a, a service to your community and to the public by reporting a, a bite to animal control. So they can make a record and they can follow their protocol. If this is a dangerous or aggressive or violent dog, there are steps that may need to be taken to protect other people. Um, and if nothing else, if the dog were to bite someone else in the future, having this first report on file may help animal control make a decision about how to protect the public from that dog in the future. And it may help someone else in the future with their case. So for all of these reasons, if you or a loved one is involved in a dog bite in Illinois, we highly recommend that you promptly report the bite to animal control. If you have any questions about dog bite cases in Illinois, we'd be very happy to give you a free consultation to talk about your case and see if we can help. And I appreciate you taking the time to watch this video. Thanks.